I'm going to show you how to make a simple sugar paste rose. So you need a little bit of just ordinary sugar paste and you need to try and get the balls all roughly the same size. So to make one about this size you need like a double sized pea and you need two ones. One is for the bud and one is for the petal to go around the bud. And then you have three, roughly the same size. And then you have five, roughly the same size. Let's just take a bit off of there to make sure they're all roughly the same. Okay, and you only need rough balls like that. You don't need them to be really smooth because that gives you the sort of ragged edge of the rose. Right, the first ball here, if you roll that in your hand and then just tip it to one side and make it into a point, that is going to form your bud. The next one, we just flatten the sides down. So you're flattening this edge. Don't worry about this edge, this side, just this edge. Make it nice and thin on the edge and then we pick this bud up, place it inside and we wrap it up in it. So it's like wrapping up a little baby there and that is all nicely covered. You can put that one down and then we've got three more to do. Just move that out of the way so you can see. So exactly the same thing again. We're flattening out the petals but just this edge. So we're not worried about this thick part at the bottom. So you see that looks like a petal shape. And the same again this side all the way around the top, concentrate on the top edge and then you lay that across the other petal and then the next one. If you do this quite quickly there's no need to glue it or anything and there's the third petal and then you pick your bud up and you place it on top of your petals and you roll it up like that. And then you just nip the bottom part together and then you can peel these petals away like that which shows your little bud off in the middle and we place that down and then we do the five petals around the outside so we start again exactly the same way so you're making it really thin around the top lay that one down next one you always work in odd numbers when you're doing this so if you do three five seven if you want to do another row around the outside you do seven um, it just works better and uh, it's more aesthetically pleasing to the eye having odd numbers so this is the third one yeah and then the fourth one you see, you really don't have to be that particular with it. You're literally just getting it thin around the top here. And the fifth one. Lay that one down. Pick your flower up and you roll it up in your petals. Just like that. And then you nip the bottom of the petals together you see that nipping action just makes the petals slightly come apart and then you just peel them away like that. Peel the petals away and then once you've got them all peeled away you just give them a little push into shape. So you just give them a little nip to give them more of a petal shape like that all the way around. And then you pull the excess paste away from the bottom and there is your flower. <laughs>